This is the thermal advantage program. So you can see it's the thermal advantage. And these are the XPS data. And I will fit here for the ox uh, one of the peak, for instance. We can make fitting for the oxygen. We have other data, lithium 1S survey, valence spectra, titanium 2P peak, and oxygen 1S peak. And for fitting, I want to choose oxygen. It is relatively easier. Firstly, I have to add background from here to here. And I want to make it bigger. Okay, I could make it bigger and I have that background so I will click this icon so a new windows open and I can select the big background type so linear, surely, to guard, smart and simple I will select smart and I can change the positions as you see so this place is good enough and I will select other one I will put it here and I will add the background so this is the smart background and I will close the background thing, thing and I will add peaks so this is the peak fitting so it automatically at one peak, oxygen one S. I can change the its size. Okay, I can do whatever I want. And a new window opens. If I want to add more, I should set at peaks. So I can add another peak. So there might be two peak for this case. And I can click the fit peaks, and one of them, one of the fitted peaks should be around here, I think. And the other should be around here. So this is a very very rough peak fitting. It's not like a cos XPS, but it is still useful, I think. Okay, so if I, uh, so in the fit peaks part, in the peak fitting, I can fit all levels. If I click it, it will fit. So I am still waiting. Okay, it finished. So accept and oh. So this is the one of the oxygen peak and this is the other oxygen peak. At the top, I can see the peak area, peak height, uh, CPS for the peaks, and binding energy of the peaks, and the other stuffs. And that's all for the peak fitting of oxygen. And I can continue with titanium 2P. It is a little harder. So firstly, again, I will select the and data first. I have to click right click on the data. I click the background. So maybe I should bring it here. I can move the this to columns to select the background start and finish positions so again I will use smart and I will say add so it added the background and I will close it then I will 
add pics again I have to click this thing so it automatically add one pic and there should be titanium 3 plus and the 4 plus as you know 4 plus binding energy is higher so it should be around here and the titanium 3 we should be around here and I want to add peak I will click add a single peak so it added one of peak here I will add one more here so there is one peak here and if I want to select this small peak, I can select it from here. If I click A, it will select the smallest peak and I can make it bigger. I can decrease the full bit half maximum. So this is for instance titanium uh, 3 plus. And this is the titanium 2P 1 over 2 peak. And this is the titanium 2P 3 over 2 peak. So I can add one more uh, peak. How can I deselect it? So if I add single peak, okay. It added one more peak. So it is titanium scan C. It's here, but I want to put it here. Okay. So I will decrease the full width half maximum of the peak. I will make it smaller the uh, 4 plus. No, 3 plus. This is 3 plus. Uh, the other is here. So 4F, uh, titanium 4 plus binding energy should be higher than the 3 plus. So this is the titanium 4 plus peak. This is also titanium 4 plus peak. So we have both of them in here. The issue is that this peak area should be double of this peak area. Unfortunately, Thermal advantage is not very useful here, so actually I have to use the Casa Express, but I don't have Casa Express right now, unfortunately, so I have to do this. So I have to adjust the, this envelope, so envelope should stick to the uh, real signal, the red one. Here is the real signal. This red one is the real signal. So it it seems it seems a little bit off, as you see. So I am just uh, I want to make this peak just by using my view. The reason is that if I try to fit it, it becomes horrible, and I can check the area. For instance, you can see the area, titanium two piece can see, which is this peak, and this peak area is right now 770, and this small peak, this peak should around less than 400, and it is good right now as you see, areas match with each other, and the area of this should be half of the this peak so i assume you know all of this important information but the problem is that as you see this envelope doesn't match with the signal so i have to decrease the uh, pull with half maximum little bit so unfortunately i cannot change the Gaussian and Lorentzian functions. Maybe I should change here to make it better. Maybe I should uh, change the half 
the tough maximum of the other one I can decrease it I should check the area again so it is still good enough uh, and I think for data interpretation it is good but of course I cannot publish it okay not bad not perfect not bad but this is the titanium 2p fitting and if I accept it it should keep the peaks and okay titanium 2p is also finished and I will go on the lithium and carbon by the way in this lithium actually lithium peak is here it is very small so adding peak is hard to hear but I will try and this is the carbon carbon is relatively easier carbon 1s 285 and that's it from today for me thank you